All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Judgment Apocalypse. In the last part, we talked a lot about stuff that had nothing to do with this game. Uh, more specifically, we talked about Pro Gamer Manager and uh, my feelings and the state on it and, and all that kind of fun stuff. Uh, but in this part, we're going to be getting back to the grind a little bit. We're going to go back and just continue doing some missions because... We really need, um, just to keep scouting. We need to keep scouting. We need to keep finding, um, we, we have to find where the, um, shoot. We have to find where the books are, right? <laughs> As I completely forget, uh, what I'm even thinking about. We have one research kit at the moment, and I was looking at the research table a little bit, and, and looking, you know, I'd like to get up to Kevlar Vess. I think that would be a good idea. But our main concern here should be weaving. Uh, we want to be able to produce cloth. Um, and once we can do that, we can make... We can self-sustain ourselves with uh, medicine. Which is a very, very, very important thing. Seeing as, you know, our guys are going to get hurt when they go into these battles. More than likely. Unless, you, unless you're dealing with, like, only hellhounds and you can just wipe them all out. Or if you're dealing with, like, just imps. If that's not the case, you're gonna likely run into some to some to some trouble. More than likely, you're gonna have to fight things that potentially could deal some damage, uh, like demons. Um, they have a lot of health. You know, it could be a little bit tougher to be able to take them down, but it's not that bad. Like maybe we lose a couple of health here or there. But we are getting a little bit of medicine stockpiled up here. We barely have any cloth, though. That's our biggest biggest concern right now, I think. We just... We need to find where a book might be. We need one book. And we will be in a pretty good spot. Because then we'll be able to actually get some, uh, get some weapons produced. Um, as, well, really we need like three books, because we need two books for this weapon parts, and once we can get these weapon parts up and running, you know, then we can start getting into things like, you know, advanced pistols, or advanced firearms, or, you know, automatic weapons, things like that, because, you know, we want to be able to make the weapon parts. Which, it might not be a bad idea to get automatic weapons anyways, because Uzis might... See, I'm still really, really, really nervous about taking on, um, where's one of them? I forget the name of them. Oh, they're like all around here. I'll just go right over here. Um, these guys right here. These Karothenax, they look terrifying. Um, so... I'm just scared that it'll just wipe my entire party, and that'll be that. And I'll just be like, well, that was fun, guys. We lost absolutely everybody. Now we're not going to be able to do anything. Uh, so, kind of just trying to take it a little bit slow here. Not push, you know, not push it to the point where it's like, well, we lost everybody, you know, over something really stupid. Like, you know possessed guys are pretty tough as well and so are ghosts these fallen angels though are probably like gods like ghosts and possessed are really terrifying ranged units um they deal crazy damage i feel like all right so david heal yourself up did you get healed up you did all right harry heal yourself up harry and then we'll uh we'll head out do some missions um what's this mission have up here three demons a reaper and an imp just for some clay and stuff well we kind of want to do it just because it will give us more knowledge we need to we need to be able to scout out a little bit farther here uh another leather vest would be good we can get that guy uh, produced and just keep on keep on grinding here it's gonna be a little bit of a grind um, but that's kind of how these games are you know these games there's always gonna be 
a little bit of a grind. You know, it's not going to be like, oh, bam, speed run. Like, I guess you probably could if you got really good at the game and you played it a lot. But, you know, as of right now, no, we're not going to be like speed running the game. More than likely, uh, it's going to take a little bit of time. And this is a terrifying spot right here. Grace, get back, get back, get back. All right. I'm sure the other demon will get spooked here in a second. There he is. Uh, Grace, go ahead and pull back. I don't want to have you. Oh, snap. It's a flank. It's a flank. We walked right into their trap. It's a good thing that the other demon died before the other one came around the corner. Uh, Grady is tired. I don't care if you're tired. Grady, what do you think this is? A charity? We have a lot of wool. We have like a crazy amount of wool. Really, we should probably get a dark altar. Um, I don't know what that does. What does it do? Uh, the dark arts are powerful, but also are dangerous, but also powerful. Huh. Could be an idea. We have the magic circle right now, which... What does it say? Uh, something about this formation keeps the dabblers in the occult safe as they conduct their experiment. Okay. Well, that's cool. Um, anything exciting? We found a book. Well, you know what that means. Uh, actually, it's just two hellhounds. We probably could go and do it. Let's just get it, because that book is going to be really nice to get. Uh, Harry, I know you're tired, but now is not the time to go to sleep. We got things to do, because once we can get that, we can get weaving, and then we'll have all... The cloth we could ever wish for, which I assume probably just uses wool. Um, man, the, I, I can't believe... I feel like... Alright, so the game is still obviously in development. I feel like they need to make these books a little bit easier to find. Because it's like... I guess we haven't really done a whole lot of exploring. Like, there's still a lot of map left to go. But, I feel like they're, they're way too hard to find and too many researchers require them you know what i'm saying so the fact that we need a research to be able to make something that we've you know probably used like i wonder like think about the rp side of this it's like well we showed up we found a book on you know making cloth for dummies that's that's what we found guys we made making cloth for dummies all right I'm not too worried about this. The two Reapers are the only thing somewhat scary about this whole mission. And really, two Reapers are not that bad um, if they don't get you, like, cornered. Uh, you should be fine. But once they get back, we will be in a decent spot. Um, that's not a bad idea. The gathering efficiency could help out a bit. Um, what else is probably good here? We don't want to use anything because we want to keep it safe. Oh, I say keep it safe. We want to be able to, you know, have it for later when we, uh... We don't want to waste the, the research vials, is what I'm trying to say, but really failing at saying. Uh, we still can't mess with this Hellgate. That's impossible. We'd go in there and get slaughtered. Eight legions, five fallen demons, eight succubus, four possessed, three demons, two liches, and... Well, the four hellhounds are, like, simple, but... Yeah. Can't... Can't mess with that yet. So we'll get weaving. Good. Which should now allow us to produce this which we're going to auto craft and make well how much we have medicine at 30 so we'll need double that for this so 60 will be what we need it only takes wool which we probably should get a second sheep farm going maybe even a third sheep farm going um just so we're able to actually you know make sure that we keep up with our with our wool count we don't want to run out of wool uh, assistance needed oh oh 
Yeah, no, you're screwed, bro. I'm not taking on two of those. That's way too hard. We can't do it yet. Not yet. We're, we're not there yet. Eventually, hopefully, we will get there, but, but not yet. One day, maybe. Uh, firearms, crafting, defense, structures. Meh. Might not be a bad idea. He has construction one. Let's go ahead and give him defensive structures. Um, because we don't have someone to do that yet. And it might now be the time to maybe look at... Either saving up for automatic weapons or... I'm thinking automatic weapons are the way to go. Um, or we could... Tr well, well, we're looking out for another research kit so we can get this. So we can get up to Kevlar eventually. Uh, tailoring is a good idea as well for the science research. That's a good idea. Because... Or not for the science research. For the scrap armor. Sorry, as I... You know, fail to be able to speak English here and read English. You know, it's like, it's not my first language or something. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, this worries me because I don't know how tough that thing is. And I'm afraid I'll get ambushed with multiple ones. And that thing will come by and just slaughter us. So if we can find a mission where it's just kind of easy and that one thing is there... Maybe there's one other thing or, or, you know, like an imp, that and an imp, I'd be, I'd be game to take that on. Uh, but I, I just, I don't know how strong it is, so I have nothing to judge it off of. And I don't want to risk, you know, going in and, and losing, you know, my entire, uh, the, the entire squad of decent guys just because we don't have quite the amount of weapons that we would hope for yet not yet one day eventually we're gonna get the weapons we need but for right now we don't have them yet this is potentially an okay one hmm we could try and just speed it up a little bit and get an uzi maybe where at least research automatic weapons try and get up to an Uzi. Or wait for tailoring and get that scrap armor. That would probably help a lot as well. Uh, we'll go ahead and approve that. Well, nobody needed it, so what's the point? <laughs> that was dumb. That's not a problem. Alright, it needs 250, so we're getting there. Soon. Come on. Research! We can do it, guys. Oh, no. Dark clouds over the night sky. The soft glow of the moon breaches blah, blah, blah. I think we've had this one before. Demonic howls can be heard. Yeah. Enemy attack strength is increased. Who? Ronald, get in there and get that taken care of. Wasting too much time all the time. All right, so... Scrap armor is scraps and cloth, which gives two armor. Uh, ten evasion, so slightly less evasion, but one extra armor. I think it's worth it. I don't think it, it's... I think it's probably worth it, right? One extra armor means, theoretically, that we soak up one... You know, we, we take one less damage, which is good. Um, obviously, it's probably not like Kevlar, which Kevlar is probably like the best you could probably get but maybe we take a mission on maybe which one was it one of these this one right here not a bad idea here let's give it a try all right so everyone's got leather vests which is good uh, let's get the crew together. Four of them with guns, one of them with a bow. Let's go. We're gonna do it. It's gonna be the last thing we do before the part ends. This could go horribly wrong. We could lose everyone here. 
but there's only one way to find out. Let's get the tr let's get the crew together. All right. All right. We want an open area where we can get a good shot on them. Uh, Harry, I think, had the extra spotting. No, was it Max? Who had it? David? David. David is our scout. All right. We do have some grenades also. Oh, shit. There it is. All right, here comes the... Oh, that thing... A fire-spitting demon. Do not let this one get too close. Medium armor, but easy to hit. Shoot that son of a bitch. That thing wasn't even that bad. I'm terrified, though, when it says, do not let this thing get close. I am terrified that it's just gonna, like, completely annihilate us if it gets close. Oh! Alright, come on. Take it down. Wipe them out. There we go. It's probably more efficient to... Okay, Bobby. Alright. That wasn't so bad. That could have been a lot worse. Alright. Let's rush home. Uh... Hmm... Yeah, we still need some more occult research, but it's all right. We've done pretty good. I think we got some weapons there, didn't we? Yeah, a couple of weapons, it looks like. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, please hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. If you have a comment, question, or concern, leave it in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.